buy broccoli. Take the whole bunch and you can use the whole bunch, the stalk and the top part. Later in the season, you might just find little stalks of broccoli. Those also are very good and you can buy them individually that way as well. Broccoli florets. It's already convenience food. Thank you very much. Now, let's make the broccoli and black bean quesadilla. This recipe calls for cooked broccoli. When you cook the broccoli, you want to put it into a pot of boiling water and then allow the water to come back to a boil and then I cook the broccoli for about another minute. Now to keep that beautiful green color of the broccoli, drain the broccoli and then immediately put it under cold running water. After I cook the broccoli, I'll get out everything else I'm going to need to make the broccoli and black bean quesadilla. I'll chop one cup of cooked broccoli. I'll drain one quarter cup of salsa. Grate one cup of cheddar cheese, which, by the way, is a lot easier to grate when the cheese is cold. Then I mash the beans. The kids could help you do this part. Mix it all together. And I'm going to put it on one half of one tortilla. And then I'm going to fold it in half. This recipe makes four large tortillas. When the pan is hot, cook for about three to four minutes per side. All right, we are done. If you want to keep the quesadillas warm, all you need to do is to put them in a 250 degree oven. Some other ideas for using fresh broccoli are broccoli on pizza, broccoli in cornbread, and one of my favorites, broccoli in chili. Fresh vegetables, that's the best thing for you. Look, my son is 14 months. He'll eat them broccoli and collard greens like he's going out of style. That's why my son is strong. He's not here with me today. I wish he was here. He's like a little he-man. <laughs>